We're underway with racing tonight. Hero County Speedway with the 44, Keith Lucas. Forty-four, Keith Lucas up front, but here's a charge to the outside with 38, Matt Moon. 99, Wayne Sims right behind. 67, Steve Oder. Three, Arason Jason Anderson. And the 32J of Jason Jaggers. Sportsman Heat 2, align them up, please. Sportsman Heat 2. We're underway on Shirts Countryside Sales Night. Anderson drifts high, Moon, you're leading on the back stretch with Sims in second, Oder third, and Jaggers in fourth. Sims jumps to the lead. Oder in second, Jaggers in third. With 38, Moon off the pace to the back stretch. Sportsman, Heat 2, line him up. Sims will do double duty again tonight. He'll be in the zero modified as well. Oder down the back stretch. Begins to chase him as Moon retires to the infield. Four laps to go, he race one, and the BOC guesses 99 is your leader. Sims if Steve Oder is going to catch him. He's going to have to hustle. Going to have to hustle. start to pedal in just a little bit harder. Sims down the back stretch with a five car length lead on Oder. Jaggers in third. And the checker for the Sims Lawn Care 99. Wayne Sims your winner. Steve Oder in second. Jason Jaggers third. And three racing Jason Anderson in fourth. First winner of the evening. BOC Gases and Sims Lawn Care among the sponsors. In the car number 99. Put your hands together for Wayne Sims, your winner. And here's the lineup for heat race number two. Modifieds, line them up, please. Modifieds to the infield for your heat races. It'll be Richard Seeley on the pole in the 29. Double zero, Thomas Franks, 35, Cookie Wetzel, Andrew Schooley in the 40. 24, DJ Richardson. 10, Brian Moon. And 34, Brian Lucas. 10 laps the distance for the sportsman cars with the modifieds up next. Don't forget about the 50-50. You win and the point fund wins. Sportsman cars, he'd race number two with Seeley and Franks. Lead him around, one to go.
So who will it be? We'll know in 10 when they come on around, seal up at a good pace down the back stretch and into turn number three. Frank's right alongside. Everyone looks for the advantage. We're underway. Sealing out front, but here comes Cookie Wetzel. Knock, knock, knocking on the leader's door. Down the back stretch they go. DJ Richardson in third. Richardson tries the inside line under Cookie Wetzel. Wetzel drifts up to the wall. The 10 of Brian Moon in fourth and fifth. Here's Andrew Schooley. Schooley tries to the inside as Moon drifts. Moon as slides on down. front stretch. This will be the 34 of Brian Lucas into the wall and rolled here in the front stretch. And we have caution. The safety crews over quickly to check in with Brian Lucas. And Brian's out of the car and a okay. One to go with DJ Richardson and Cookie Wetzel. Brian Moon, Andrew Schooley, and Thomas Franks. Seven laps still to go. Apparently the 29 of uh, Sealy retired from the lead during that last caution. So we'll double him up with Richardson and the 35 of Wetzel. No go. Everybody needs to be in the correct order here and in correct position for the restart. And so we'll send them around again. Be as far as we can be about this here on Shirts Countryside Sales Night. Let's watch them down the back stretch into three and four. And let's go racing. DJ Richardson out front says, hey, I like this starting on the front row. Stays on one of the machine car. Go later.
White flag, one more for DJ Richardson. Here's Moon with a charge for a second. He looks to the inside of Cookie Wetzel. Wetzel shuts the door. At the checker, DJ Richardson. Cookie Wetzel. Brian Moon. Andrew Schooley. And Thomas Franks. Beautifully prepared race car, a carpenter during the week, Kilter Crafts, Steve's Automotive Machine Shop, Rathbun Painting. Among the sponsors for this Henry-based driver, put your hands together in the car number 24 on Shirts Countryside Sales Night for DJ Richardson. Donald Bell and Tim Kimry in the 99. Sean Evans and Alan May in row two. Tom Jensen and Mark Burbeck. Mike Garland in row three. 10 laps the distance, modified, heat one. And we're underway. Kimry, your leader, there's Evans on the low side of Bell and Alan May on the outside as they're running side by side the battle for second. Kimmery, your leader with May up to second. Sean Evans still running the low side with Tom Jensen. Here's May with a challenge and the lead to Alan May. in second, Kimmery in third, but he's got a big challenge from the 41 at Jensen, the one of Garland and 62, Verbeck. Uh, and you can watch the laps countdown on the Coors Light scoreboard. Jensen to fourth underneath Kimmery, Garland tries to advance. Modified E2, line them up, late models, you'll be after the modifieds. have moved out on their own, but that battle three, four, five, and six is close, close, close. Kind of like the air out here tonight, isn't it? It's a hot summer night with hot summer modified racing. One to go. The 62 of Urbeck in third, the 33 of Evans in second, and here's your winner. From Elmwood, sponsored by J.C. Dubal, 
a heavy equipment operator and a farmer. On Shirts Countryside Sales Night, your winner is Alan May. Hot chocolate, buy one, get one free while supplies last. Modified Heat 2. Zero Wayne Sims in 60, Robbie Verbeck. I see the 81 Mel Hoopers move to the outside. Here's 21 Carl Beatty. 25 Marty Thompson. The M6 of Randy Marring. And 60 Verbeck is dropped to the tail of the field as we're underway. Here's Mal Hooper has to get on the binders. Carl Beatty looks to his inside to take advantage. That's the battle for second. Sims, your leader. Hooper trying to retake second as Sims drifts high. Hooper with a hard move to the inside. Hooper to second. Here comes Marty Thompson and Jeff Maher. So the zero of Wayne Sims from Tisco, a year later. Princeton's Mel Hooper in the 81, then 22, Jeff Maher, Minerals Marty Thompson, the M6 of Randy Maring, and the 60 of Robbie Verbeck. Unofficially, seven laps to go. Seven laps to go. Sims leads the field with the lights clear, the status lights clear. Here they come. Thompson down to the low side, it's three wide in turns, one and two. Now Maring looks to get underneath Maher with Wayne Sims caught on the outside. Late models line them up, you'll be next. for third. And Marty Thompson begins to stalk Mel Hooper with three to go. Thompson right underneath your leader, Mal Hooper, trying to use the inside groove. So far, no pass now. Thompson has to deal with Maring. We are one to go. Good, close, competitive, open wheel, modified racing. Just the way we like it here at Bureau County. Two turns, a checker, a glass of milk, and a big cheer. Here they come through three and four. From Princeton, Mel Hooper, your winner. Marty Thompson, Randy Marin, Jeff Maher, Wayne Sims, and Robbie Verbeck. Well, how's that for a pretty good modified heat race? He comes from Tisqua, sponsored in part by Princeton Firestone, Elmore Electric, Sims Lawn Care, and Sims Construction. 
As it comes to the victory lane, here's the statewide builders, car number 81. The Supreme Oil Car, that's your winner in the 81, Mel Hooper! Two late model heats, so it'll be 32D Darren Miller and 27 Brian Byers. 23S Flip Schickel, the winner of our Hard Charger Award. 25 Marty Thompson, who'll have to change race cars. And the S10 of Junior Schickel. So we'll have two heat races tonight for the late models. He raced number one with Darren Miller on the pole. He raced number two with Mike Cothran on the pole. Street Stocks, if you want to get lined up on Pit Road, you will be next on Pit Road, Street Stocks. Meantime, it's late model, heat number one, we're underway. Darren Miller and Brian Byers, Marty Thompson and Flip Schickel, Flip Schickel with the early advantage. Thirty-two D. Darren Miller of Chadwick is your leader. Brian Byer, second Marty Thompson, Junior Schickel, and Flip Schickel. Halfway through. Miller is considering starting his own race. Junior Schickel moves on Marty Thompson. Marty Thompson closer to Brian Byers, but nobody close to 32 D. Darren Miller, your winner. Byers and Preston Thompson. Junior Schickel and Flip Schickel after that. Heat race number one for the late models this evening. Street cars, we need you lined up on pit road for your heat races, please. Street cars. Shorts Countryside Stales with steel power tools and Dixon's ZTR riding mowers. Your sponsor tonight, Napa Auto Parts and Terra, some of the sponsors. He comes from Chadwick, 
Put your hands together for 32D, Darren Miller. Here's heat race number two, and I think this is a different race car, although it looks the same. For 75, Mike Cothran, Bruce Johnson in the 10J. Roger Rebholtz in the 10, the 112 of David Tuff, the 04 of Larry Yardley. Streetcars, line them up on pit road, please. Streetcars, your street heat races. Only way to feel cooler this evening is to buy a stack of 50-50 tickets and fan yourself with them. See the folks downstairs at the table? I'll have all the details for you. Mike Cothran, your leader, we're underway. After that big roll of the race car last week, Catherine's got to get out there and make his way around. It's Roger Rebholtz in second. Streetcars, where are you, please? Streetcars to Pit Road. For a second here with David Tuff to the inside. Roger Red holds up high. And Mike Cothran leading the parade down the back stretch. They go there still side by side for a second. Tuff with a slight advantage. Cothran, your winner. And Rebels, one, two, three. As they bring them round to the Shirts Countryside Sales Victory Lane, Kathy Casarison is sweltering down there, but she's going to keep all the sweat off the photos. Auto bomb and some contractors. Race engineered components as well. Put your hands together for Mike Cothran, your winner.
We're underway with Breckenridge on the pole. Thirty-five. Bob Goodman jumps to the lead. Street E2. Let's line him up. Forty. Sandro Andrew Sime in second. Car spun here on the front stretch. Axle coming loose. Wheel doing a dance and the caution flag. Photos. 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 You want some souvenir photos? Of the racing action here at the Bureau County Speedway, Kathy Kasterison has all the photos for you, along with copies of Hawkeye Racing News and other souvenirs as well. Beneath our grandstand area and sharp action videos here tonight with all the highlights you can rent or buy with the folks from Sharp Action Videos. See them in the Beer Garden area after the races, maybe during the races, and reserve your copy. We'll go racing once during the week with taped action here at the Bureau County Speedway. Bob Goodman appears to be in a hurry here. He is your leader. Streetcars, we need you right now with bombers behind. Streetcars, we need you in the pit road or right now. for Bob Goodman. And that'll be race number one for the streetcars. From Edelstein, a body shop manager, the car number 35, sponsored by WAJK Thompson Seamless Gutters, Harmon Auto Parts, Superwash, Hardline Graphics, GST Productions, and Battery Plus. Put your hands together for 35, Bob Goodman Jr. Here's street heat number two, bombers to pit road, please. Bombers to pit road. It's Larry Stamberger in the 100 on the pole. 25, Brian Cook, 71, Buddy Boyd. 44, Andy Lucas. There's nine, Todd Balancephan. And 76, Eric Balanceefen. We're underway, Larry Stamberger, your leader.
And now up to the front, 71, Buddy Boyd with Brian Cook trying to make his way under Stamberger. Buddy Boyd leads him through, it's Brian Cook. And Lucas after that. Randy Lucas trying to battle for a second under Brian Cook with Buddy Boyd, your leader. Lucas on the low side of turn two, down the back stretch they come. White flag, one more. Here's the checker, 71, Buddy Boyd. 44, Randy Lucas, 25, Brian Cook. 76, Balance Ethan, nine, Balance Ethan. And 100, Stemberger. He comes from Polo, Illinois. And he'll bring it round here to the Shirts Countryside Sales Victory Lane. Polo Automotive, g, g Auto Sales, the sponsors. Put your hands together for Buddy Boy, your winner. It's Jason Lee in the 66X. Shepard in the three. Clark in the 91. Steve Wetzel in the 35. John Ryan in the 12. Derek Hicks in the 56. Kevin Hoffman in the 58. And we're underway. David Shepard in the three, Wetzel in the 35, here they come. Bomber Heat 2, let's line them up please. Bomber Heat 2. Derek Hicks to second, John Ryan in third. Bomber Heat 2, line them up.
Steve Wetzel right up against the wall, your leader. Derek Hicks from Tampico in second. And John Ryan of Lamoille in third. White flag and one to go. Bomber Heat 2, line them up. Jared Lee in the 66X has to come to the infield cool off area and they take the hose out. Here's your winner, Steve Wetzel with Derek Hicks and John Ryan. David Shepard, Clark, and Kevin Hoffman after that. In the car number 35, Pizza Seller, the hitching post. Feed Store, Thompson Automotive, Woodford Signs and Designs, Heartland Auto Body, Forestall Concrete. A concrete finisher during the week. He likes to go racing on Friday nights here at Bureau County. From Bureau, Illinois, 35, Steve Wetzel. Bomber Heat 2, Bomber Heat 2. Chris Hicks in the 17, Harry the Thacker in the 25, Brian and Garrington 98, Gary Wetzel in the 18, Jamie Bell and Seifert in the 57, 46L Josh Reed, scheduled for this event. No start, we'll try it again. Here we go. And Heather Thacker leads the field on the high side with Wetzel right behind. Chris Hicks down low. Carrington and Balance Ethan try to edge their ways up as does McCutcheon. Here's your leader, Heather Thacker. <laughs> Jamie Balance, even the 57 in second. 17, Chris Hicks, 98, Brian Carrington. Pretty good battle for the lead here. Let's watch him through the turn. Fifty-seven, Jamie Balancy from your leader, Heather Thacker, back to second. Brian Carrington in third and Chris Hicks. With two to go.
Carrington underneath Heather Thacker had a little bit of push in turn two. Carrington to second. Now one to go for Jamie Balancefa. Heather Thacker spins in the back stretch from Walnut, Illinois. Heather Thacker comes to a stop. Second place goes to Wyonette's Brian Carrington. And your winner from Princeton, Jamie Balancefin. And that'll be the heat races this evening. Heather Thacker gave it a good run up front early on. Some mechanical difficulties on the backstretch, and her car come to a stop. And here's your winner, Williams Construction, Lucas Motorsports, Public Discount Auto Parts, Raymer Automotive, and Balancefin Farms, all sponsors for this construction laborer from Princeton in the car number 57. How about it? In the shirts, countryside stales, Steel Power Tools, Dixon ZTR Riding Mowers, Victory Lane. Your winner is Jamie Balancefin. Behind our pace vehicle this evening from Faber Motors. One, two, big wave, make it cool, three, everybody! And you see the salute from the drivers going out to you, the race fan. As you salute the drivers, the mechanics, the car owners, the family members that allow the time to make our favorite sport a reality every Friday night here at the Bureau County Speedway. Shirts Countryside Sales, the sponsor tonight. 20 laps in the Coors Light Bureau County Scoreboard with Keith Lucas and Thomas Franks. Status lights are clear, head for the hills, here come the sportsmen! Oh my, we got a parking lot in the back stretch. And Joan was thinking more of your stomach than she was of her own personal financial well-being. Which was good, but Joan came to her senses and claimed her money. <laughs> Joan Scott of Ohio is the winner of the 50-50 tonight. Sportsman feature, 20 laps. Keith Lucas on the ball with Thomas Franks. Keith Lucas done in the pole, he's your leader with 35, Cookie Wetzel, 99, Wayne Sims, 24, DJ Richardson.
Your one, two, three running pretty close. Lucas, Wetzel, and Richardson. Forty Andrew Schooley, ten. Brian Moon, bring out the caution. Twenty nine Richard Seeley, and Keith Endress in the twelve. All Corey Endress, all spin to avoid. With twelve laps left to go on the scoreboard here on the Shirts Countryside Sales Night. Forty four Keith Lucas, thirty five Cookie Wetzel, twenty four. DJ Richardson, 99, Wayne Sims. The 38 of Matt Moon and the green flag. Halfway through. Richardson continues to challenge Wetzel. It's Jason Jaggers under Wayne Sims. Jason Jaggers of Wyonette up to third with Princeton's 
Cookie Wetzel in second and Keith Lucas up front. Modifieds, you should be in line, please. up for the last lap. Here they come, the checker. Your leader up to the wall in four. It's 35, Cookie Wetzel, your winner. With Jason Jagger second, Richardson in third, Schooley in fourth. Oh my! Something broke in turn four for 44 Lucas. And that's all she wrote. What disappointment for the 44 team. Pulling to the Shirts Countryside Sales victory lane. Dick Shirts of Shirts Countryside Sales will present the trophy. Lake and Marina, Midwest Auto Parts, Thompson Racing Engine, Harlan Auto Body, Woodford Design, and sign the feed store and watering hole. All sponsors. Well, you got to lead all the laps, including the last one. Here's your last lap leader. How about it for Cookie Wetzel? Congratulations, Cookie Wetzel, Dick Shirts from Church Countryside Sales with the trophy tonight. Doesn't get much more exciting than that, does it? With a big wave and a cheer, let's salute the modified drivers, race team owners, mechanics, everybody big wave and a cheer. One, two, three, everybody. Well, the reason we had to do the crossover, because the zero car of Wayne Sims, the pole sitter, with some mechanical difficulties, you see everybody pouring over that car in the infield. Meantime, Sean Evans in the E33 assumes the pole with Mel Hooper on the outside, Alan May and Tom Jensen, and the green. Sevens in the E33, Jensen 41, Allen May in the 15.
tied in the middle for second with Garland, May, and Evans, and Marty Thompson halfway through. Nobody's been able to challenge Mel Hooper, your leader, Mike Garland, second. the laps dwindle down Alan May and Marty Thompson exchange some sheet metal that's the battle for third the green flag means two more laps for Mel Hooper in the car 81. Mel Hooper, your winner. Mike Garland in second. Marty Thompson in third. Alan May, Sean Evans, Randy Morin, Robbie Burbeck, Tom Jensen, Carl Beatty, Jeff Maher, Mark Burbeck, Tim Kimmery, and Don Bell after that. How about it? Mel leads wire to wire. First victory of the year for the Supreme Oil Statewide Builders. Car number 81, there's a party in Victory Lane. Joe Shirts and Dick Shirts of Shirts Countryside Sales for Steel Power Tools and Dixon's ETR Riding Mowers, the sponsors, as he gets his helmet off. Here comes the Hooper family. How about it for Mel Hooper, your winner! Big smile, Mel!
Faber Motors with the Vic, with the Pace vehicle as they come on by. Big wave and a cheer for these late model drivers, their families, crew members, car owners. Big wave and a cheer. One, two, three, everybody. Twenty-five laps the distance, Junior Schickel and David Tuft. Mike Gothrin, Bruce Johnson, Brian Byers, Marty Thompson, Roger Rebholz, Darren Miller, Flip Schickel, and Larry Yardley. Oh, street cars, line them up. Here come the late models. It's not how many race cars you got, it's how good the racing is. Three wide for the lead. Junior Schickel, David Tuft, and Mike Cothran. Battling it out here at Bureau County.
cars, you should be lined up for your feature in street cars. Your leader, Junior Schickel in three and four. Easy victory for Junior and Sickle. Mike Cothran holds on David Tuft. That's the battle for second and third. Darren, John Darren Miller and Bruce Johnson, unofficially the rest of the top five. And Junior Schickel dominates. A multiple feature winner here in the late model division. Joe Schertz and Dick Schertz with Schertz Countryside Sales for Steel Power Tools and Dixon Z TR Riding Mowers. Gail Frank Racing Engines, Bonkers Place, Accurate Towing. R.A. Benson Motorsports, PFM Racing Fuel, some of the sponsors. From Bloomington, Illinois, Attorney Ted Priester, the sponsor as well. Come sliding into victory lane. In the S10. And here comes the racing crew from the Shekel family. Your winner, Junior Shekel. Big smile. Hey, that was filming that one. Kathy Kasteris in with a victory photo. Let's introduce the field. For tonight's Street Stock Cars, it's 33, J.D. Rutledge and Andrew Samay in the 47. Big wave and a cheer as they come on by. Here is your street feature. Fallon Seifen and Pardo in row two. Brian Cook, Matt Polich, Buddy Boyd, Bob Goodman, Randy Lucas, John Breckenridge, Larry Stamberger, and Eric Rebholz.
So, it's Rutledge and Samay up front. Alan Seifen and Bardo in the second row as we go racing. The 48 car, John Breckenridge tries to redecorate the front stretch. As a wheel come off in the process, and that'll bring caution. Eric Balancey for your leader. 25 Cook in second, and we've got a car stop. That's J.D. Rutledge up in turn three. J.D. Rutledge. Spud Balancey for and 25. Brian Cook, 35, Bob Goodman, 71, Buddy Boyd, 40, Matt Polich. Bad luck for Eric Balansupin as something lets loose under the hood in turn four. Bob Goodman assumes the lead. Coming the car spun on the back stretch. Andrew Samay in the 47, I think one of those. That is the reason for our caution. So Edelstein's Bob Goodman leads the field. Brian Cook, Randy Lucas on the green.
Muddy Boyd has been coming through the field like a rocket. He's up to fourth. Here's Goodman, your leader. Lucas, Cook, Boyd, and Polich after that. Buddy Boyd will look to make that third place battle close as Bob Goodman. He's got his own area code, his own phone company, in fact. He's way out in front. Bob Goodman Jr., your winner. Randy Lucas, Brian Cook, Buddy Boyd, Matt Polich. Rick Bartow spins in the 82 car. All right at the close of our street feature tonight. Not the first feature win this year for this body shop manager from Edelstein, Illinois, WAJK Radio. Thompson Seamless Gutters, Harmon Auto Parts, Superwash, Hardline Graphics, GST Productions, and Battery Plus. All sponsors with Joe Shirts and Dick Shirts with the checkered flag tonight from Shirts Countryside Sales. Here's Bob Goodman, your winner! All right, with a big wave and a cheer, let's salute the bomber drivers! with Chris Hicks and Dave Shepard. Heather Thacker and Gary Clark. Ryan Carrington and Steve Wetzel, Dave McCutcheon, John Ryan, Jamie Valenceef and Derek Hicks, Kevin Hoffman, Gary Wetzel, Jared Lee, Josh Reed. Oh, we got him up in the air and all around the back stretch. Good sportsmanship from Heather Thacker and Dave Shepard to keep on rolling. We're back on the green.
Debray up at the top of turns one and two brings out the caution again in our bomber feature. All behind the 17 car, which is your leader, Chris Hicks. Derek Hicks in the 56. Derek Hicks of Tampico is your leader with 17 Chris Hicks in second. And the 35 of Steve Wetzel in third. Seven to go, and here's the green. I don't believe everybody missed everybody over there. 25 Heather Thacker, 17 Chris Hicks, spin in two. Five down, seven to go, Derek Hicks, John Ryan, Gary Wetzel. One, two, three, status lights are clear. We're going racing next time, bye. Good sportsmanship by 17, Chris Hicks. He keeps it rolling. 35, Wetzel tries to move on, 56, Hicks. Here we come to the final check of the evening. It is Derek Hicks, your winner. Steve Wetzel, John Ryan, Jamie Valensiefen, and Gary Wetzel, your top five. And one more time, we'll gather in victory lane, Joe Schertz and Dick Shirts with Shirts Countryside Sales for Dixon's ETR Riding Mowers and Steel Power Tools. 
We thank them for their sponsorship of the racing program this evening here at the Bureau County Speedway. As Kathy gets ready with a victory photo, Mechanic Derek Hicks is your winner. Dean's Tap, Washout Plus, m and Laundry, Cernovich Towing and Salvage, Thompson Automotive, Vestretti's Garage, Midwest Biosystems, Van de Gord Construction, all sponsors. He's out of the race car. Put your hands together for Tampico, Illinois. Derek Hicks, your winner.